to do firmware updates on some of these keyboards. I know people get very like frustrated with with getting some of these updates how to change some of these colors which is right behind me and i'm going to show you guys how to do that now not all keyboards have this functionality so we're gonna th this is just for rocket check whatever keyboard you have and it might have some sort of um so other software that they might use now, of course, if you guys are brand new to the channel, make sure you guys do consider subscribing. Make sure you guys do smash that thumbs up if you guys are enjoying this content. And as always, if you guys are um, using any of these products, shoot me a message. Leave me a comment below. Let me know what you guys think about this one. Okay, here we go. We're going to go ahead and test this one. And I'm going to show you guys how to get into this app right here so this is rocket swarm now if you guys don't know about rocket swarm this is something that you need to get so right now it's already looking at like hey this is the vulcan 2 do a simple google search or whatever your search engine is and search rocket swarm um, i'll also leave it in the description below so to use and install the product correctly please download vulcan 2 max module via auto updater so we're going to click on this link right here and we're gonna click on install. Looks like there's a new update. So just give it a few seconds. You're gonna get a couple things that says setting up device, disconnecting, reconnecting. It's just gonna be back and forth. So just let it do its thing there. And there we go. Now it's back. So here we go. Um, you could do sound effect feedback, no typing sound or clicking sound if you want. So kind of curious what this sounds like. And I should probably hit apply if I'm gonna do that, huh? Okay. So I don't know if you could hear that, but as I'm typing, you could hear the sound there. So I, I, I could see how that can get annoying pretty fast. So we're going to go, oh, look, and it, it does typewriter sound. It does beam sound, sci-fi sound. That's kind of interesting. Let me hit apply and see how the sci-fi sounds like. Wow. Okay. So that, <laughs> that's, yeah, no sound, please. You could also set up the volume and all that stuff pretty easy. Um, you could do profile switch, wake up sound, sleep sound. So with all the different profiles, whoever is using it, you can do that. Um, the colors on this thing is slightly different. So you could do general features. This is here. Key assignments. Um, this will give you like all your macros, your basic functions, rocket functions, smart key functions, system OS, internet, multimedia, open timer, all that stuff. And you got all your slots right here. Um, all your different gaming profiles if you need now of course you got profile manager macro manager smart key manager um so if you need any help with that you can definitely you know just click on anything here and you should be able to see exactly what's what okay so we're gonna hit close now we're gonna go to key illumination now right now i could set up the brightness and of course i could dim it down if i want or turn it all the way off if i want um Pretty simple, pretty easy. Um, if you do, it's kind of hidden right here, but if you do AMO intelligent lighting, this is a state, it's a state of the art intelligent lighting system that reacts organically to your behavior without the need for extensive configuration. So anything that you do, this keyboard is just gonna naturally do it. Um, we're gonna go ahead and, and pull up the bottom camera. That way you guys could see this and here it is there's the bottom camera there's the top camera now if you do click on this thing here they have different sets so we could do a wave and you could do the speed the brightness whatever just make sure you hit apply and it kind of grays out and then it'll pop up again and then as it's doing it you'll see right here now the keyboard is doing it too um we could do snake and it's cool because this kind of tells you exactly what it's doing let's go speed we could do different themes. Um, let's do this purple theme. I kind of like that one. Um, and then let's hit apply. So again, grayed out. Check the keyboard out right here at the bottom. And now it's doing its little snake thing. <laughs> it's kind of just, just doing its own thing at will. And it's cool because the light even comes down here towards the bottom. So even, even the pad lights up. So that's also pretty cool. Um, you could do you could do heartbeat again 
just choose your different themes. If you like that red, you could do that red. And it kind of just does like a simple heartbeat right there. Just lots of different things here. Breathing is actually kind of cool because it looks like it's actually breathing in and out. Um, and then, of course, you could speed it up there. So, again, if you hit apply, give it a few seconds. It's it's transferring all the data over. And there it goes. Like it's breathing. <laughs> so, pretty neat. Pretty cool. You could do full lit. Just one solid color. You could do fade effects. Um, and this just kind of like goes around the entire keyboard. You could do a ripple effect. That's kind of like when you click on something, then it'll do its own thing. You could do a custom mode and just do whatever you want here. A lot of cool things here. I, I, I like this wave thing. I'm going to slow it down. Um, I like this wave thing. So that way it just, you know, just filters throughout the colors here. So pretty simple on how to customize it how to keep your firmware update um, this rocket swarm is what is going to do for all of it this is where it's at um, one last thing too if you went to key assignments list view you could actually see all your keys here exactly what every single one of them does pretty nice cool let me know what you guys think um Again, this keyboard is, is, is a beast of a keyboard. And if you guys are interested, shoot me an email, rojasentertainment at gmail.com. Check the description below because I always try to leave you guys some discount codes and whatever I can get my hands on. Um, and yeah, some pretty cool stuff. With all that being said, you guys take care, take care of each other, and I'll see you guys in the next one.